Kevin Moses here, your certified functional diagnostic nutritionist. And today I got in, I got in my hands the hormone test, the functional uh, adrenal stress profile. Why do we look at hormones? Well, hormones are our chemical messengers of our body. And we have over 200 hormones at all times doing something or other, controlling something, right? We got cortisol, DHEA, insulin, glucagon, leptin, um, you know, testosterone, pro progesterone, melatonin. It's endless. They're on and on and on. And they do so many functions. One's for energy, one's for sleep, one's for mood. Again, endless, okay? But the ones that I look at, I look at cortisol. So we do a test with a saliva test. We look at cortisol four times in a day. Cortisol is that stress hormone that wakes us up in the morning, gets us up out of bed. It should be highest in the morning. It should gradually go down throughout the day. It's a circadian rhythm of cortisol. So we're looking at the, 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 your rhythm of cortisol. Is it highest in the morning or is it higher at night? Every time of the day that we do this test tells me something about you, okay? A lot of my clients have low energy. They wake up feeling fatigued. Guess what? I don't even probably have to do this test and I know that their morning cortisol is low, okay? And a lot of times, maybe their, their, their nighttime cortisol at 10 o'clock, when we look at it, could be elevated. So that means something, the low cortisol in the morning means something, are you in adrenal fatigue, stage two, stage three, look that up. You know, if you are constantly bombarded with, you know, feeling low energy, fatigued, you should get your hormones checked, okay? So we're looking at four cortisols. Not only that, we look at DHEA. That's the hormone that counteracts all the negative things that cortisol does. DHEA does all the positive things, okay? A lot of, lot of benefit, precursors to other hormones, okay? So if DHEA is low, that tells me something, okay? We look at two estrogens, estradiol and estriol. Very important estrogens are these, are these high levels in your body. If they're higher levels, weight loss may be really a challenge. So many people think that counting calories is the answer for losing weight. Well, there are so many other factors and knowing your hormones is going to be definitely one of the best things you can do for weight loss, mood, energy, sleep, the list goes on, okay? Testosterone is important, we look at that, progesterone and melatonin, okay? These are the vials that we get. You want to, you know, spit in that until you get to a certain level. Um, you can even use chewing gum, sugar-free, to help with that saliva. It's not easy to get that much saliva. I've done this test multiple times, and I always use sugar-free gum, so that is suggested. Um, if you do need that, there's other requirements in here. But if you have any questions, let me know. It's a very affordable test. You get a lot of information. Again, I'm Kevin Moses. I'm a diagnostic nutritionist, which allows me to work with this lab, BioHealth and get and figure out your hormones to help with whatever concern you have. So hit me up, 858-442-9054. Uh, Take care. Bye-bye.